Today we'll take a look at the Semitex Docker agent and demonstrate how you can use it to monitor Docker metrics, events, and logs. In this video, we'll focus on log management for Docker. The Semitex Docker agent works with SPM, a performance monitoring, alerting, and anomaly detection tool, and also Logzine, which is a centralized log management tool. Logs are shipped to Logzine, where they are indexed and made searchable, while metrics and events are sent to SPM. And perhaps best of all, both SPM and Logzine are integrated into a single UI and are available both in the cloud or on-premises. First, let's see how to run this Docker agent. You run it by using your standard Docker run command along with some additional parameters. So here we need to specify the Logzine application token, the optional SPM application token, the host name, Docker socket, and the image name. And that's it. Now that we have the Docker agent running and collecting data, let's describe quickly what this agent does and how it works. The Semitex Docker agent is a small, free, and open source Docker container that runs on each Docker host and collects Docker metrics, events, and logs from all containers running on that host and also from the host itself and collects data via the Docker API. As soon as it starts, it automatically detects all running containers and it automatically detects any new containers subsequently launched. The Semitex Docker agent is a turnkey solution for Docker operational insights. Logs are not just collected and shipped, but are actually parsed and structured. And this is a major boon because it increases the value of logs by making them not just searchable, but enabling all kinds of reporting and analytics that can be derived from logs collected by the Semitex Docker agent. And all of this is done out of the box for an increasing number of known log formats. The Semitex Docker agent includes advanced features, things like masking sensitive data often found in logs, such as PII, PHI for HIPAA compliance, reducing storage requirements via log filtering, and secure transport of data to its destination. Now let's quickly see how easy it is to get started with Logzine. After logging in at semitex.com, we can create our first Logzine app. The Semitex UI shows the Docker run command line, including the application token, to run the agent. That's the Docker run command line we saw just a bit earlier. If you run containers on Tutum, you can use this deploy to Tutum button and have the Semitex Docker agent running on every node managed by Tutum in a matter of minutes. About one minute after the agent has been deployed, you'll start to receive data, which you can analyze in the SPM and Logzine UI. So let's have a look at what we get when we launch the agent on Tutum. When we enter a query, Logzine suggests matching, recent, saved, and existing alert queries to save you some typing. The Logzine UI provides easy to use filtering capabilities buttons for every field, so you can quickly slice and dice logs however you like. When we click on the Analytics button, Logzine generates queries for each Docker image and displays the results for the top Docker images in a stacked bar chart and separate result tabs. And this is useful when you're trying to find an outlier among your containers. The Semitex Docker agent detects the log format and splits log events into multiple fields, including their type, such as string, date, number, and so on. This enables building of sophisticated log analytics. All logs are automatically tagged with container ID, container name, and image name. Having such well-structured logs is the basis for creating analytics dashboards like the one we're gonna show now with Logzine's Kibana integration. Kibana's rich visualization and dashboarding capabilities create all kinds of reports and dashboards from your logs. And remember how we mentioned log parsing earlier? This is why it's important. Nicely parsed structured logs and Logzine's Kibana integration let you create reports with statistics about your container usage, top errors, and more. And for those of you who prefer Grafana to Kibana, have no fear, we've got you covered. Grafana versions 2.6 and above work with Logzine as well. All right, so let's sum things up. Perhaps the biggest benefit of using SPM and Logzine together is having your metrics and logs in one place, accessible in a single pane of glass, 
for the whole team or even the whole organization. And the value of this is huge. It makes troubleshooting an order of magnitude faster compared to using disconnected monitoring and logging silos. This unified view of all key bits of operational intelligence gives DevOps engineers access to things like all key Docker metrics along with logs and events, alerts and anomaly detection, and integrations with chat ops tools like PagerDuty, Slack, and HipChat. All this is very easy because you get the information from the Semitex Docker agent. We've gotten good feedback from users so far. It's simple to run, and you'll have all your Docker operational insights in a matter of minutes. So give it a try.